Hey folks, Dan here from Lead With Nature. We've got a new bird for you today in Learn A Bird, and it's right above me. It's doing some perch singing, sitting in the same place, occasionally. There it goes. This, my friends, is the prairie warbler, also known as the level up bird, because it sounds like you just won something in a video game. You've achieved level nine. Anyway. Warblers are these small, colorful, interesting birds that migrate all the way from the tropics all the way up here to the temperate regions. This bird needs edgy open habitat. It needs kind of like, it can't do well in a dense forest. It needs low open shrubs, open ground, um, and it hunts its way around those areas eating a lot of insects, um, as well as seeds, nuts, all sorts of other things. But when it's raising its babies, it needs tons of insects because that's the good stuff that raises babies fast. There it is, the prairie warbler. Let me show you what it looks like here. Tiny bird, very yellow, with little streaks. So if we look here at the prairie warbler on this page, you can see it's got uh, black streaks down the side. It's kind of a little bit, a little olivey color on top, and the male's back actually is a little bit of brown you could sometimes see too. Kind of hard to see, but tiny little bird. Sings way up high in the trees usually, sometimes down low, because they like open areas. Uh, a group of, of warblers in general comes with a number of names. Uh, one of my favorites is a wrench. So you could see a wrench of prairie warblers. Interesting fact about the prairie warbler, um, after its young hatch, as opposed to picking up the eggs and flying far away and dropping them so predators don't detect that there's a nest nearby, this species tends to eat the eggs and reabsorb that calcium, maybe use it in another brood or use it in some other way. So, <laughs> You hear that? You're hearing a prairie warbler. Hope you enjoyed today's episode of Learn a Bird. Go to leadwithnature.com. Ask me some questions. If you're looking for a COVID-conscious nature guiding experience, I am available for those as well. So be well. Take care.